What's up guys, welcome to Apex, thanks for tuning in. Samsung has rolled out a brand new update for Samsung clock application, which is the default clock that we get on the Galaxy phones. And this update brings in some important new features. And these features are straight from the Galaxy S24 series, which is currently available on One UI 6.1. And what's surprising is this update has been rolled out for the older Samsung Galaxy phones. This is the Galaxy S22 Ultra I've got here. And unfortunately on the Galaxy S23 series, I don't see this update yet. So let's go ahead and take a look at what we have got with this update. Let me show you the change log here. This is the change log for the clock application. The version number here is 12.3.20.16. And the update was released on 26 February 2024. Now you see in the change log it says provides a feature to change the alarm background, provides a feature to adjust the vibration intensity for each alarm limited to the select supported models. So this feature may not be added on all the phones. That is something to note here. Then we've got provides sunrise sunset times on the detailed screen for each city on the world clock. Then changes the timer so that it is displayed in the minimum size when it switches to the mini timer. Added the selected alarm ringing condition to uh, modes and routines. Now these are some important features which have been added for the Samsung clock application. And let me break this down for you in this video. Let me open the clock application here. I'll tap on alarm. Now whenever we create a new alarm, you see I can select the time here then we have got all these options here and at the bottom we have got alarm background. Now using this feature we will be able to set an alarm background of our choice. Let me tap on this. You see this is where we select the alarm background. We have got background option on the top. I'll tap on this. We've got three still wallpapers and we have got two video wallpapers as well. Uh, let me just open this video wallpaper here. It, you see it begins with darker shade and uh, we have got this lighter shade uh, merging with this wallpaper here. This is a video wallpaper we have. And here this clock can also be customized. Let me just tap on this clock. You see we get three different clock options here. Uh, which you can uh, select from. That is the first feature we have got. Now let me just open the Galaxy S23 Ultra here and I'll show you uh, the alarm here. You see when I select a new alarm, I don't see this wallpaper, uh, the alarm background option on the Galaxy S23 series. Now let me just go to the uh, vibration here. Now you see here at the bottom, we have got this new feature. We have got this vibration intensity. I can increase or decrease the vibration intensity here now on the S22 Ultra or let's say on this latest clock application. Whereas on the Galaxy S23 series, when I tap on vibration, I don't get this vibration intensity slider here at the bottom. Uh, and now it is available on the latest clock application. I'm sure even this device will be getting uh, the update very, very soon. So let me uh, keep you posted probably in the community forum. I will uh, drop a message for you guys as soon as we get this update here on the Galaxy S23 series. Now let me just go back. Let me give this aside. Now the next feature is in the world clock section. Let me tap on world clock and select one of the clocks here. Now you see we get sunrise and sunset information right here on this window. Now this wasn't there in the previous version. And let me again show this on uh, the Galaxy S23 series. When I select the world clock here and tap on a world clock here, you see we don't get to see sunrise and sunset information on the previous version. On the current version, we have got the sunrise and sunset information here. The next feature which has been added is in the timer section. Let me tap on timer and let me just start uh, this timer here and I'll go back to the home screen. Now you see instantly it gets minimized here. We get this minimized capsule here as soon as we go to the home screen. Whereas in the previous version, uh, we get a larger window here. Uh, it will not directly go to this capsule. Uh, it will get uh, this particular uh, small window and then it minimizes into a smaller capsule. Let me show you that. Now let me start this timer on the Galaxy S23 Ultra. I will go to the home screen. You see it minimizes into this window, whereas on this particular version of the clock, when I start the timer and go to the home screen, it instantly gets into this capsule mode, uh, whereas on this one, it gets into this mode first and then it gets into the capsule mode. That's another change we have got. The last feature which has been added is the selected alarm ringing condition to the routines or modes now have been added. Let me show you that. Now this will not be available on the clock application. We need to go to the modes and routines. Let me tap on settings here and tap on modes and routines. Let me tap on routines and I'll tap on plus button here to create a new routine. Now when I tap on this if condition uh, and scroll down, you will see we have got a brand new option here under clock, selected alarm dismissed. I can select this. Uh, I can select a particular alarm here, let's say 6 a.m. and done. 
Now, after we set this if condition, we can set any of the then condition that uh, we want for this particular alarm. Let me tap on then. Now, what I'll do is I'll probably go to connections and tap on Wi-Fi connection. Uh, I will select on uh, because uh, I will be turning off the Wi-Fi in the night. So as soon as this alarm goes off, uh, I can turn on the Wi-Fi, I can tap on done. Now you see the uh, then condition is Wi-Fi on. Now for this particular alarm, uh, I have set this uh, then condition Wi-Fi. I can select any additional conditions that I want. I can turn on the location services. I can turn on sound mode or I can turn off the vibration mode. So any of the then conditions we can set. This is a very, very powerful feature, uh, the routines, modes and routines on the Galaxy phones and Samsung makes it more powerful with every update that we get. So modes and routines is something which you must try if you use a Galaxy phone. Now this is a new feature which we have got on uh, the Samsung clock application. Uh, in fact, the feature is integrated into the modes and routines feature where we can select an if condition as selected alarm dismissed and then condition whatever you like. Now, these are some of the important features which have been added on uh, the Samsung clock application. Let me know what do you think? Have you already received this update on your uh, Galaxy phone? Which phone do you use? And whether you have got this update or not, drop a comment. Uh, for now, I am seeing this update on the S22 series. S23 series is expected to get it in a couple of days. And uh, this uh, S24 series already has got this along with the One UI 6.1. Now, this is not exactly a One UI 6.1 dot one feature these have arrived with an update to the application itself uh, so make sure to check the update for this app and start using these features that's about it that's all i want to share with you guys if you haven't subscribed to the channel go ahead hit the subscribe button and smash the like button if you find this video informational thanks for watching my name is salian signing off cheers bye, -bye.